Welcome to this demonstration on how to take a design from Fusion Live and quote it in Quote Master and from there take it to Factory Manager 2 which will give you a cutting list for the for this kitchen. As you can see we've got a design already done in Fusion. What we're going to do now is take it to Quote Master 2 and give it a, a quotes. The first thing we do is we go to Tools and then Export to Quote Master. It's going to come up with the password. I haven't got a password, so you can set it to, to any password you like. Um, it opens up into Quote Master, and you'll notice it brings up all the different the, the units that are, have, were in the kitchen. Obviously, you're not going to be costing your walls, doors, and windows. Unless you are, you can put those into the program and, and cost those. But right now, all we're doing is costing the, the cupboards. So what we're going to do is we're just going to make sure that all these all these are, are correct so I need to, you can put on scene sides you can make them both left and right you can put on your exposed sides for any of these and it will, will add to the cost um, if you've got something other than white okay for now I'm just gonna keep everything as is I'm just gonna go import and I'm importing not only the the cupboards but the customer name and and all the info for this for this job from from Fusion. First question that comes up: BICs. This is not applicable because it's we've got a kitchen and not BICs. So I'm just going to continue on these questions. Okay, now it's pulling through the the corner um, 90, the L-shaped corner unit. I'm just going to go for a, a melamine standard unit. Done. Okay, carcass material. I keep it at white melamine. The prices are also shown. These prices will be set by, by yourself and, and whatever pricing you get from your board um, suppliers. Concealed carcass edging. You can put on any kind of edging you like. I'm just going to go for a cherry, PV, uh, cherry PVC. Exposed carcass edging. Let's again go for cherry handles now in the handles you've got a handle allowance or you can choose from these these range of of different handles handle allowance will put on a cost and give you a quantity but it won't specify which handle you want for the customer and the customer can choose later which which handle he wants okay legs or no legs this is box system or or with the little leg system at at the bottom adjustable legs i'm going to go for the legs scene side material this is your exposed sides I'm going to go again for cherry. Let's go for Memphis. Uh, you can choose between a variety of different different colors, as you'll notice here. I'm going to keep it at at the cherry melamine. Door thickness for that unit. Uh, biofold doors yes or no yes and you'll notice it will continue to ask questions until you've finished uh, building up this this unit again I'll choose a cherry okay now you'll notice it starts pulling through all the different units and giving you a price at the bottom masonite backing hinges Okay, on this one you can choose the different um, draw types that you, you're wanting to use. If you're wanting to have a, a soft close, you'd type in 4 and go next. Handles per pot draw. And again, let's go for 4. Again, let's continue through. and it will just ask and you'll notice the price will, will increase every time you're just putting through a, a unit these are these questions are all customizable you can ask the questions or you can just take a continue one and let it let it cost it its, itself so for this kitchen at the moment this is with no markup at, the, at all we'll put in a markup just now and 
we will see the, the exact cost. Let's go continue. Glass units now. Glass shelves. Choose the door that we want. I'm going to go for a shaker recessed. Painted. Let's go for a medium color. And we can type in cherry and continue on. Let's just finish off the questions. Depending on the size the size of your of your kitchen, that will be the size of the how many questions you would you would ask as well. Okay, there's our cost in, in rands. We can go to our margin and set it to let's go forty percent a margin. So that's sixty seven. That's good enough for now. You'll notice here your material costs and your profit for this job. Let's continue down and you'll notice the, the cost there. From here you would take it into into factory manager and the way to do that is to just go to order and to factory manager. So once we've got our cost and the, the customer is happy with the price we would take it to, to factory manager and get a cutting list. And it's ordered now to, to factory manager. Well this ends the presentation on how to export from Planet into, into Quote Master and to order it to, to factory manager. Thank you so much.